Howdy, this is Josh Beckner here from the School for International Expedition Training and today we're going to talk about the 6 to 1 fillet system. And if you haven't already seen our 3 to 1 fillet system video, check that out before you move on to this because we're going to be building on the 3 to 1. Now, we're going to quickly review the 3 to 1. So essentially this is the load strand and it goes up to the petal reverso and this is the brake strand that comes out of the reverso and the brake strand comes down to our tractor and clips into a non-locker on the tractor. Now our tractor in this case is a uh, three wrap Prusik, a standard Prusik. So to haul with this is pretty simple. You just grab a hold of the brake strand and pull straight on up. Now, in this case, the brake strand, you can pull them in opposition and get a little bit more pull. Now, to make this six to one, we're going to build another pulley system, a two to one pulley system in this case, onto our pull strand. So I'm going to make a clove hitch on the pull strand, clip it with a beaner, it can be a locker or a non-locker, and then we're going to go to our tie-in strand. And in this case, I have uh, not tied in to the rope, uh, just for clarity's purpose, purpose. So we're going to get this out of the way. But if you follow that tie-in rope up to the anchor, then the back side of the tie-in is what we're going to use for the two-to-one pulley. And the two-to-one pulley is fixed to a clove hitch up at the anchor. And then the two-to-one pulley comes down to the pull strand of our three-to-one and clips into that carabiner. Now, you can pull these strands apart and see the whole system. Now, from that tie-in strand, it goes up to a clove hitch, um, to two bomber equalized pieces, and out of the back side of that clove hitch comes this strand, and with this strand, we're going to build the two-to-one. And that's as simple, as clipping it to a moving pulley. And now, where it's fixed at the top, and the strand on the two to one comes down to the moving pulley. This is the moving pulley now, and this is the pull strand. Now we have a two to one here. And when we took this two to one and added it onto the pull strand of the three to one, we multiplied the forces. So two times three is six. And that's what creates the compound pulley. So to run this thing, I can simply pull on that two to one and pull down on the brake strand at the same time. And for every six feet I pull, I only move my load up one foot. So if you have the choice, you definitely want to go with the three to one because you can move the load one foot up uh, by just pulling three feet of slack in. But if there's too much friction in the system, like in this case our rope is going over a big uh, grainy edge and uh, there's a lot of friction there. So the six to one is probably going to be the way to go in this scenario. Now, what you can also do is take this pull strand and clip it to a beaner, in this case a quick draw, and you can clip it in to the master point and by doing this, I can pull down on my six to one, like this. I could even put a clove hitch in here 
and clip that into myself and just walk it backwards and use my body weight to make this happen. Now, as soon as I clip this into the redirect up here, I've added more friction. So that is one thing to consider. Ideally, if you can, you're going to be pulling straight upwards on these systems. Now you can see I've pulled a bunch of slack through here and I can't really pull anymore. So now it's time to make sure that the reverso has got the load, and it does. And then I just simply need to reset my tractor, my primary tractor that I started with on the three to one. Now when I reset that, now I can pull again. Now, eventually, we're going to get to the point where you're going to need to adjust this clove hitch. And to do that, you can just simply loosen it up and you can simply pull slack through the clove hitch as needed. And then continue pulling. You'll need to do that half as much as your three to one. Excellent. That is the six to one. Thanks for watching.